So, um, hi and welcome to my tutorial of how to do long division. Now, first of all, this number right here is your divisor. And this number is your dividend. Now, first, can 6 go into 8? So, let's say we have 8 dots right here. Can 6 go into them? Yes, there's 6 right here. So 6 can go into it. How many times can 6 go into 8? Well, I have our multiplication chart right over here. Well, it can actually go into 8 one time because without going over 8. 6, 12. That's over 8. So it can go into it one time. So we put the 1 right here. Now we go 6 times 1 equals 6. Put your 6 down there. Now you have to bring down the 7 because you've done nothing with it. Now you subtract. You put the 7 down here because you brought it down. 8 minus 6 equals 2. Now, 6, can 6 go into 2? No, but can it go into 27? Yes. How many times? Well, the closest we can get is 24. Right, uh, that's four times it can go into it. So we put the four right beside here. Now we go six times four. Well, six times four, 24. Right, I think, yeah. Okay, 24. So we put our 24 down here, minus again, seven take away four is three. Two take away two is zero. Can six go into th zero? No, can it go into three? So that's it. But now, this number, what do we do with it? That's our remainder. So there we go, remainder equals 3. That is one where this number can fit into this number. Now we have another question. Can 6 fit into 3? No. But can a 6, six fit into 34? Yes. How many times? five times. So, we put the five above the four, because it can fit into 34, not three. Six times five uh, equals, sorry, I'm not very good at basic, uh, basic uh, multiplication. Whatever, equals 30. And subtract. 4 take away, sorry, 4 take away 0, 4, 3 take away 3, 0, can 6 fit into 4, no, that's our remainder, remainder equals 4, now, if you didn't get this, I'll go a little slower, and show, sorry, and show you on this, another example, hold on, can 8, go into 8. Yes, it can. How many times? One time. 8 times 8, I mean 8 times 1 equals 8. We put our 8 down there. Bring down the 1. Minus 8 take away 8 is 0. Remainder equals 1. Did you get that this time? Now, that is how to do long division with remainders. Uh, you might have seen any every other tutorials, like things like some really short tutorials, or people write it out like six thirty six, and they go six one twelve two eighteen three twenty four. Four, uh, <laughs> thirty-five, thirty-six, six. There's thirty-six. So there ain't a six right there. Now that's that's not right. So um, as you can see, my little cursor. I think I said that right. I'm not sure. It says YouTube rocks. I'm not sure if you can see that, but that's what it says. So thank you. Uh, subscribe if you'd like.
comment if you'd like. Rate if you'd like. You can write. You can rate poor. I don't care. Just write or something. Anything. Bye.